Hello to the nation, Dr. PlayStation Nation here to talk to you guys over a little bit of Mods for Noobs, guys. The series where I teach you guys how and what you need to know in order to mod your Minecraft. So, this is going to be episode one today, guys. This is where I'm going to be teaching you guys basically the bare bones. If you have never modded something, this is what you need to know. And some people who have been doing mods for a while don't even know about all three of these things that you need, uh, or at least should have. So, I just uh, deleted basically all of my Minecraft stuff, so it's all new right now now and I'll be going through the process of how you're going to actually uh, get it prepared for mods. I'm not going to install any mods as of right now, but I will teach you guys how to prepare it. So, uh, for me personally, I have these three links here. This one, obviously, .minecraft is a shortcut that opens up my app data in order for me to get to it quickly, but for you guys who do not have this, it's a high suggestion that you guys get it. You hit your Windows key on your keyboard and run, or you guys can just go here and just go run, and then it'll do that uh, and then in here you're going to type in the percentage sign APPDATA app data and the percentage sign then you're gonna hit enter and this window is gonna pop up now if you have already run Minecraft you should have this folder here if you have not ran Minecraft yet please run it for the first time uh, so then you got this dot Minecraft folder you're gonna open this up now, in order for you guys to proceed with this next step, open up bin, guys. So you've got Minecraft and then bin. In order to proceed with this next step, you guys are going to need WinRAR, guys. Uh, I will link in the description to a the, the WinRAR site in order to purchase it, though a lot of people do not like to go purchase it. There is illegal sources, which I will not link to, but possibly you guys could go on YouTube and type in how to get WinRAR for free, and you guys should find it. But uh, if you guys don't have it, you have to go get that, because right now when we open up this Minecraft.jar, it's going to open up default with WinRAR. If it does not do this, you're gonna go File, Open With, so right click, right click, and then it's gonna go Open With, and you're gonna go WinRAR. This is gonna go open up your WinRAR so that you can see all of the files in this jar file. Now, first thing is first, you need to go right here and go to this meta.inf. This is basically Notch's way of making sure mo mods don't happen. It just it screws up everything, makes it uh, incompatible and whatnot. So what you have to do is just click on it, make sure it's selected in blue, and hit delete. And then it's, are you sure you want to delete meta.inf? Yes. So that deletes all your meta info. So that's the number one thing you want to do. Uh, and then after that, you're going to install three things, guys. Three three things that are pretty simple. Oh, uh, sorry, the wrong folder, backup folder. Uh, these are the three things. Now, I always keep this folder here. It's my Minecraft mods, and there's the pre-mod folder. This includes Forge, Mod Loader, and Mod Loader MP. Now, Mod Loader and Mod Loader MP are slightly different. Certain things from Mod Loader MP work, uh, help mods work in servers and stuff like that. Mod Loader helps mods work in general. And Forge is just for specific mods so that compatibility issues don't arise. And they're fairly simple to install, guys. So what you're going to do is you're going to right click, go open with, open with WinRAR, you guys. You can't just click on them because it'll open up with 7-zip and it just won't work out properly. Basically, all you're going to do from there is select everything. I just use Control A or you guys can just click there and select it all and you're going to just drag it over drag it right over click ok and there you go you got your first step done then you're going to go to mod loader you're going to right click go open with open click open with winrar you're going to go here select all of these things yet again and bring them over click ok and there you go then you're going to go back over here go mod loader mp Sle oh wrong <laughs> i even did that wrong right click go open with winrar then you're going to go like this, select them all, and bring them over, click OK. And you're done, guys. This is one of the most simple steps of uh, modding. After that, you guys can get your mods. I'll show these in later uh, videos when I'm actually doing reviews on mods, uh, different mods like this, and then you just have to drag them in and do certain things. Uh, so stay tuned for more episodes, guys. This should have worked. Everything should be working properly. Let's launch Minecraft to find out. Let's just log in, play offline. And as you guys can see, it is launching. So there we go. We got it working. We got all this stuff in here. Obviously, this is the first time I've booted it up. So there we go. Uh, so that's basically mo uh, mods for noobs. That's the first episode, guys. That's how you install those three things. Those three things are essential to make all your modding easier, guys. Anyway, stay tuned for episode two. And I guess I'll see you at the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, consider leaving a rating below, it would be greatly appreciated. Also guys, if you already haven't, remember to subscribe to join the nation, and if you guys did, uh, did miss some of my past videos, the video on the left is a portal co-op session, a little let's play that I did with my friend Josh, and the video on the right is a let's play I did with my friend Pocket Island, and it's a survival Minecraft let's play. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, I'm the Doctor, and I'm out. Peace.